10 or 30 reps per set. Which one is better for strength and size? Today we are going to look at study to find the answer and the results may shock you. So guys, in this video my goal is to answer the ultimate question. Which one is better, lightweight or heavyweight? Can you train at home and grow or you should go to the gym and lift heavy heavy weights? Let's figure it out. So today we have an awesome study where they took 18 men, they were training for 8 weeks and they were divided for 2 groups. One group were doing 8 to 12 reps, heavy sets till failure, 3 sets per muscle group. The second group did 25 to 35 reps till failure, 3 sets per muscle group. And after 8 weeks they measured size, 1 rep max for bench and squat and 50% of 1 rep max till failure. So basically size, strength and endurance. So right here guys I have the results. Green color for the 10 reps, blue color for the 30 reps. First results for the bicep size. 5.3% growth for the heavyweight group and 8.6% growth for the lightweight group. Are you kidding me bro? 33, 34, 35. Just kidding bro. To get these results 35 reps should be till failure man. This is how your 35th rep should look like if you want to grow from lightweight. Quad size, 9.3% for the heavy group and 9.5% for the lightweight group. Not much of a difference. And for the tricep size, 6% growth for the heavy, 5.2% for the light. It's incredible guys. It means that lightweight works even if your goal is to build size. And this is right here is the answer for some of you who ask me why I use 25 rep range in some of my exercises in the next workout app. Because I was training at home in rep ranges from 8 to 25 and this is allowed me to build the most aesthetic and shredded body that I ever had. If you're ready to transform brother, download my next workout app link in the description and start your transformation. You will never regret it. Alright guys, moving on. We're not done yet. Because this three measurement was for the side. We have strength and endurance left. Let's check it out. Strength, one rep max for the bench grew for the 10 reps group for 6.5% and only for 2% for the lighter weight group. It means that if your priority is strength, it's much more effective for you to train with the heavier weight. Guys, if you find this video helpful so far, please leave a big thumbs up for YouTube algorithm. Thank you. But are you ready for the endurance? For the 50% of one rep max bench, it means that if your one rep max bench is 100 kg, you will take 50 kg and you will max out. And for the heavy group, performance drop for 1.2%. For the lightweight group, performance grew for 16.6%. So guys, overall, based on this study, it seems like lightweight is more beneficial than heavyweight. Because you will get same amount of growth in the size matter, you still will get strength benefit and you will get a lot more progress in endurance. But of course guys, 30 reps till failure is much more harder workout than 10 reps till failure. So your ideal workout program should combine lower rep ranges and higher rep ranges. This is guys what you exactly will find in my next workout app. Home, dumbbells, gym and awesome challenges. Best workout app for natural athletes to turn your body into a freaking beast even at home if you have no equipment. Because we have levels from the complete beginner harder, 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 harder and there you go. You start from the easiest version and you grow to bodyweight master. Thank you so much for watching guys. You can download the next workout app using link in the description. And also don't miss this video on 6 best exercises at home that help me to build aesthetic body. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. God bless.